Just got off of an uh, an amazing sea trial. Remember when you used to get those, those free AOS? Guys, what a, what a what a sea trial. I'm starting my video. I'm gonna walk the entire show. Calcutta, absolutely amazing. Um, I'm Thank you for what you guys do for us. I'm gonna Thank show you. them an amazing sea trial. I'm gonna I'm gonna put some footage right now on B-roll so they can see it. Um, I'm a fan. Guys, <clears throat> wait for it. We're gonna begin. So I'm gonna start my whole show now. Thank you guys for inviting me on. Guys, Calcutta over here. Wait for it, Miami 2024 show. Let's go ahead and begin the boat show. Wait a second. No, that is not dear me for dinner. Is this Hold up. This is the chit show. show. Wait for it. Wait, are you gonna do some shrimping out here today? We're doing it right now. Why don't you go shrimping tonight? There's one. I, no, no, no. <laughs> Dude, you're like one of the only creators that I actually sit down and watch. Yeah. Because when I'm on a plane, I just saw when you were in Nevada. Yeah. Cool video. With Sin City out there. That yes. Was, those were great guys. They were so like quiet and humble and chill, man. I'm a big fan. So junior and senior are, this right here saves my feet, man. I just cruised Trust around. Me, I'm, I'm in that world too. I'm there too. Hey, so when Sarah came home with these electric scooters, I was like, what is that for? She's like, you'll thank me later. Thank you, honey. Thank you. I got, I got, I got one of these. Okay, so I know that you are here with Inseta. Oh, okay. Inseta. Okay, so you're, you're here with Inseta and you're here, you're representing Suzuki? Yeah. Because you have some Suzukis on your boat? Everything. Everything I have, I have Suzuki. The Rambo. Everything. Everything is Suzuki. So you know Suzuki down here in South Florida is like big. Big, huge. huge, very, very big. Outboard specialties, Mike and Mike, those guys are great. They really turned me on to Suzuki. And so as a company, they're just amazing to work with. They're they're amazing to be a part of. And no one knows this, but I have zero signed contract with Suzuki. Everything is handshake. That's cool. Not even a handshake. I oh. say what I'm gonna do, they say what they're gonna do. Okay. And Gus Blakely is like one of the best human beings, Brandon, Cali. Everyone over at Suzuki, man. Guys, if you don't watch Deer Meat for Dinner, you have to watch this, his channel. Have you ever seen Fred the Croc from Black Point where I film? No. Okay, so I film out of Black Point Marina, the Chit Cho. Yeah, the Chit Cho. But we have a 15 foot American crocodile. I think I should kill a hog and come down there and feed it. I think it would be amazing for you to give us, you know, since you have all these alligator videos on your channel, and I've seen all the alligator stuff that you yeah. do. And you know how it is with the whole demonetization and, yeah, yeah. and all that good stuff. But we have an American crocodile and I would love to bring more awareness yeah. to the American crocodile Let's because how many times people say, you, you don't have crocodiles in North America. And I just get tired of the comment section and they're like, we don't have, we do have hey, American guys, crocodiles. I'll tell you right now, if, if we can get like a couple thousand likes on this video, I'll stop what I'm doing and we're gonna come down, we're gonna film the gator, or we're gonna film the croc, we're gonna do the whole deal. And uh, wait for yeah. it! Oh my listen. goodness, guys. This is listen, guys. I'm starstruck right now. Montaner, this meant because you know what? It's family. Yeah. And, it's all family. It's all family, right? And 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 guys, you know, I every time I come to the show. I got Black Tip H, you know, he went through a lot. Yeah. You recently have been yeah. gone through a lot and I'm glad to see you're doing good. But guys, this is kind of like a family, like whether we talk to each other or know each other, we know what it takes to do what we do. So real cool it stuff. It's a lot harder than it looks. Like right now, just him standing there with the <laughs> Yes. Right now, there's so much more that goes into this than what people see or people realize. Yeah, it's crazy. But listen, I'm gonna give you my number off camera. Sure. Guys, I gotta I gotta take a pic. We just started the video, but I gotta give him my number because this is this is awesome. Hey! Boom! Hey! If you have not already, subscribe to the Chit Show. This guy's w for real. Wait for it! Alright, alright guys. We're continuing. Wow. Um guys, let me tell you something. I did not see that coming at all. All right, we got a regulator coming out, but we're gonna walk the show right now. Uh, you see all the observers, the manatee observers? They're all on every single sea trial, guys. So you have to have them on there uh, if you wanna go ahead and see the boat. Okay. 
north side of the show much smaller guys really really small very very slow first day um, the reason I'm starting over here is because somehow some way Robert Arrington from DME for dinner and I ended up having lunch and everything that you see on YouTube is exactly the same and if you don't watch his channel check out deer meat for dinner super cool guy um, awesome he invited me to lunch and it was it was cool all right we got some tight waters here what is this so he, his actual boat is here it's an Inceta. look at this world cat so he's he's on an Inceta. Uh, 35 which we might see coming in now in a little bit you got some really nice boats over here look at this bad boy beautiful nice Jupiter guys beautiful boat beautiful beautiful we got a pursuit over here as well Oh, do we got more over there on that side too? I don't know if those are a part of the show. This is kind of like a Yamaha section here. This tide water looks beasty. There's a couple of tide waters that come out of Black Point that are just off the chain. Wow, this looks a little bit bigger though. Hey, what size is this tide water? It's a 31. 31? Damn, this thing looks beanie as hell, man. Wow. Beautiful looking boat, man. Wow, look at this, guys. That's really nice, guys. Oh boy, you guys want to see a chit show? Let's see what's up with the... Uh... Oh my goodness, can you imagine the Wii ride on this? Oh, guys, there's a lot of wind. Oh man, this, this Bennington, Bennington for the win. Wait for it. You know you guys want to stick around and see what happens. Let's go ahead and see what happens. Oh, Tritune. Oh, he's got the joystick, but he's at disadvantage. Look, look, look. Wait for. If you guys don't know about the chit show, guys, you're gonna have to watch me at the boat ramps. But these guys are professionals. So I will. Wow, this this pontoon boat is next level. Oh boy, wait for it. Oh man, I'll, I'll starve. I'll starve with this guy at the helm. There's no way, there's no way guys. We will starve at the helm. No, you saw it. I was trying to get the chicho to happen, but these captains are too good. Wait for it, wait for it. No, no, no. You know I'm waiting for it, but nah, nah. It's not gonna happen at the butcher. Not here, I'll starve. You guys watch the channel? Nice. You guys see anything you like or no? Like what? I mean, I come on, uh, honey, it's Valentine's Day. Let's get a boat together. Let's go. There's a reef runner boat in there that looks real nice. Okay, so reef runner. Where was it? On this side? It was in the convention center, right? Okay. Nice. Well, you guys enjoy the show. I'm doing my full walkthrough now. Wait for it. All right, guys. Time out. Hold on a second. We're with Bob, but I just wanted to go ahead and say, you just had the most amazing day. <laughs> Stop it! Stop it! Hey, Epic. Wait, give, give. Okay, give him your channel because I want them to Big see Wave, that video. Big Wave Studio. I'm gonna be posting the lunch that I was so fortunate to have. We're running into Alfred and then Rob as well. Um, unreal. The co the conversation that we had was all YouTube stuff. So if you want to learn how to start a channel, grow it and do it right. Uh, there's some golden nuggets that you cannot. Give miss. him the name of your channel one last time. Big Wave Studio. No spaces. All right. Thank hey you guys. Tony, you you're. Hey, thank you guys. So. I just met Robert Arrington just today, and I'm a big fan of his channel. And um, so, boy, there's a chicho going on over there for real. Hold on a second. Wait. Is that Daniel from Tuppence Marine driving? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. All right. So, so long story short, 
um, Tony just came up to me. He recognized me, and he's like, "Yo, I'm a big fan of the channel." Uh, wait for it! What's up, baby? Hey, what do you got? You live right now? I'm not live, oh, but okay, I'm I'm okay, recording. Okay. I'm recording. Okay. We got a grandpa boat. This is what I call a grandpa boat, but not <laughs> not your grandpa boat. <laughs> yeah, no, like this is this is for real. Like. Bro. Wow, this is my, beautiful. My dad just retired and he watches your show all the time. Could you give a shout out to Captain Joe from the ship? Go, show? Captain, go, go, get, come on. Hey, here we are, man. Look where I'm. Who is that, Captain Joe? No, no, Captain Joe is my dad. No, no, but that's him right there, right there. No, uh, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> <laughs> Captain yes, Joe! Sir. Captain Joe, Chin Joe! <laughs> <laughs> hey, you, Take care, bro. So, okay. So, guys, I'm telling you. This, this, you can't script dates like this. And that's why I think that there's no coincidences. I hope this uh, music doesn't drown out. Oh, look at that little switch. So you need another spotter? Yes. All right, so you have to have a manatee spotter. That's a lot of people for okay. that little switch. Um, all right. Guys, I know, it's, I know it's hard. I know it's hard. Let me, let me get back into the program. Let me tell you what's going on. So over here, so you guys can. So Tony came up to us, to me, um, cause Robert was like, hey dude, I'm starving. So we went, he invited me to lunch and we talked to Tony. I talked to Tony and Tony was like, hey, you mind if I ask you a couple of questions? And I'm, I'm like, I'm, I'm, I've been there, you know? So let's go, all of a sudden, Robert's like, well, let's go do it over lunch. I got you guys. Then we're at a restaurant. Next thing you know, we're doing an interview with Tony, which you just saw on his channel. And I'll tell you, it's a great video to watch. And it's just, it's just those moments that just don't happen, guys. Like, there's, that's not a coincidence moment. That's, okay. that's okay. divine intervention, just putting people in your way so you can just be successful, right? So, so we're gonna continue. We're actually, where we started, we just got off of the Ansetta, but now I wanna show you guys the whole show. I did see, oh boy, we have a, a Yamaha boat here. Is the Yamaha boat with all the music? Yeah, I like this Cape Horn here too. I saw these guys earlier, and um, I want you to see this right here. Oh boy, we got a lot of music out here, guys. I don't know if I'm going to be able to use a lot of this content. So. Let me see this boat. Cape Horn in the house. Guys, I did a video of, in Annapolis. Of a 32. 36 right here. Beautiful boat. This is the Suzuki section, by the way. Hey, I got footage of you. Yeah. I listen, listen. That's not happening. Listen, don't believe my lying eyes. <laughs> right? Is that what you're going to say? I didn't yeah. crush it anyway. Dude, I got footage. Do I have right. to show the receipts? Show go me, back, show go me. back, go back, go back. Receipts. Wait, I'm innocent until proven guilty. Absolutely. Listen, <laughs> only because you put a 50 in my pocket, <laughs> I'm not going to post nothing. Post it, bro. I'm liking the C, bro. What is this? This is the new 292 C Pro. Uh, it's the new 29 footer, so it's basically uh, the bigger brother for the 226 and the smaller brother of the 32. So this is a 29 feet? 29, 29 foot, 10 between. foot, 6 beam. So when are you going to crash this one at Black Point? Next Saturday. Wait for it! <laughs> Oye, no te hagas la loca. I know, I got you. <laughs> I got you. <laughs> Guys. Let's shit go in. Chip show. C pros over here, Suzuki's every Suzuki section over here. And uh, I'm like I'm liking boats. Guys, I'll tell you the show is considerably smaller on this side. Why? I don't know. But the show did start off very slow too for the for the beginning first Wednesday. So hopefully you guys get excited and come to the boat show and see all the see. 
Oh boy. Okay, so. It's boat, dude. A shallow sport, and you got East Cape here as well. Oof. Look at this, guys. What do you guys think? Wow, this is nice. So different. All right, we're gonna eventually get to the other side of the show as well. What's up, love? You're on Hello. speaker, by the way, and I'm filming. Oh, uh, well, I guess I'll call you back. What, uh, is it important? No. Well, it's... Well, I just, I'm driving, and I cut you off earlier, so I was wondering what else you were doing. No, no, I'm, I'm actually filming right now. So, guys, this is Mrs. Montaner, by the way, my wife, my beautiful wife that is actually right now Hi. taking my kids to a Valentine's lunch, I'm assuming, right? Yep, and then movies. I've actually been running around doing stuff for them all day. You know who I just met over here? No. I just met one of the biggest YouTubers that I'm actually a fan of here, and I just had lunch with him. How crazy is that? Wow. Is your Valentine? Well, not really, but is, if that's a personal day at me because I'm working the boat show on Valentine's Day, you won. Get whatever you want. Okay. Sounds like a plan. All right. Well, I love you. I'll talk to you later. I love you too. Bye. Right. It don't get any realer than that, guys. Mrs. Montaner, the strength behind Alfred Montaner. Uh, taking care of the kids, right? Uh, behind the scenes. Plus, she's a realtor, so you know, if you need a house in South Florida, look her up. All right, we got a sea chaser here. And, Inseta, actually Robert's boat, was right here a little while ago. So, I know Robert's not on it because him and I just had lunch. So what happened, they went on a sea trial I would love to do a sea trial on that boat. You guys can see it. Big old Freemans, guys. Look at these monsters. 42 LR. Suzuki power, baby. Hey, how much fish has this boat seen? A lot. I, it looks like it. It's super clean and I, I just, I see the remnants of, of memories on this thing. This, this hole has about 5,000 hours on it. 5,000 hours? I think I did a video with you years ago on YouTube. Might have. Might have, right? Yeah. Yeah, you look familiar. You're like a captain, right? You're a charter captain. Yes, sir. Yeah, I did do a video with you. What's up with these 42s? Um, these are just our offshore boats. So it doesn't Freeman now have a bigger one, like a 47? Yeah, they have a 47 and a 43. 47, 43. Is a 43 and the 42 much different? Uh, the 43, I believe, is three inches wider. Which is a lot. Yeah, which is a lot. Yeah. In, in boat terms, that's a lot. Yeah. Especially in width. Yeah. Wow. Hey, you guys are always killing it at Freeman, dude. This is the same boat, different color. Yeah. 
That's a 42 as well. Guys, when you go to Hallover Inlet and you see a boat just rip Hallover Inlet, or no matter whatever weather, most of the times is a Freeman. Those things are notorious for the Hallover Inlet. It's just such a capable boat. What do we got here? Oh, we got some nice, we got some nice looking boats. Now, let me tell you something, guys. My expectations have been raised after I went to the Dusseldorf uh, boat show in Germany. So I need you guys to watch that video. If, you want, if you're watching this whole full walkthrough, I would encourage you to wa uh, watch the Dusseldorf Germany boat show. It is incredible. Um, and I'll tell you, like I said, my expectations were raised on what I'm looking for because I was really surprised at what I saw as far as quality, fit, everything. Over there, manufacturers from Poland, uh, Croatia, actually even Ukraine. I even did some videos. Okay, so last year there was an additional dock area all along this area i don't know why it's not there this time i do know that there's i do know that there's a lot of uh um things that you cannot do because of the manatees and this is eventually where we started wait for it all right so i'm gonna get back to the other side guys we're gonna go to this side of the show now and then hopefully maybe I can go ahead and get on uh, on that Enceta and do a sea trial of that boat. Yeah, Be right back. Oh, look at you! So I'm filming the whole walkthrough. I told them, dude, this is crazy. I, I left here. I got off of the boat with you. We were doing the sea trial. I met one of the biggest YouTubers in all of YouTube, like in our niche. Yeah, yeah, your genre. Yeah. And I just had lunch with him. It's just oh, nice. been a wild ride. Good. You like your hey, coach, you know? hey, and I'm going to do a sea trial with him too right after I did a sea trial with you guys. He He's a badass when it comes to hunting and fishing. No, He's a badass. Um, Deer me for di uh, dinner. Gave, yeah. The guy, he had the stroke. Yes. Doing? He's doing fine. He's doing really good. He's, he's a doing, he, he, he's a tough, I like him. tough he's mother like, effer. Yes. He, he's a beautiful person. And I just, and I, and I, I, can, know, I, 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 I just, I'm like telling you, I just had lunch with him and he's exactly what people see on YouTube and it's pretty cool. It's cool to see that because I, I'm on the other side of what people see me, which is kind of crazy. So. Anything else? Any other sea trials you guys did? Right back up. Um, I'm thinking with the small one. Yeah, we took we took a group of uh, Yamaha guys out. Three quarters. Oh. And I told them, hey, by the way, you know, this isn't a normal one. This is an experimental. It's got a six liter twin turbo. And one guy who speaks English looked at me like, that's correct. So, 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 just kidding, so, just kidding. so they look like they're from Japan, Yamaha. Uh, well, but I think most of them are from. Uh, Kennesaw. Okay. Uh, Yamaha USA. Yes. But they, I think they're there as employees. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm going to go on and get to the other side. Maybe I can film a chicho with this wind. I don't know. Maybe, maybe. Oh, boy. Hold on. This is it, guys. Wait for it. Hold on a second. Guys, hold on a second. Excuse me. I got to get this crash. Give me a second. I saw one last year and I predicted it, by the way. Don't think I, it, it's not possible. That's a beautiful boat. I'm just trying to show off the pursuit, really. All right, guys, let's go ahead and get to the other side. Oh my goodness. Guys, Alfred Montaner, and we're at the main event, my friends. All right, so we just got here to the dock side. I wanted, I started off on the, the north side, right? This is the south side of the docks. We got a lot of boats that way. Let's, let's work our way. Let's show some love this way first. Oh man, oh man. I hope I didn't get that guy picking, picking for gold. Oh, he was picking for gold, and we're, we're, 
We're not talking about the gold that you think. We're talking about valueless gold, my friends. There's no value in that gold. Wait for it. A rib boat. I love me some rib boats. Hey, where are you guys making these? So we, we build all our boats in a factory in Vietnam. All the way over there? Mm -hmm. And we import them. 50% of all our builds are custom builds. And aluminum too, huh? Aluminum, Achilles. Uh, the customer has a choice of any type of color combination that they want. Uh, uh, EVA flooring. Uh, what do you mean by Achilles? Huh? What did you say, Achilles? Uh, color combination. Oh, okay. So they could choose any type of EVA flooring uh, pattern, their cushion. Um, so we use all high-end products. Suzuki and Tahatsu Motors and, uh, uh, come standard with our boats. $17,500? Yeah, that's our boat show special. Usually 19. 19,000 for this boat is $1,500 off. This with, boat a, is actually, with a 30? With a 30, yeah. It does about 31 miles an hour. Dude, that's huge. Yeah. And what, what about this guy here? What, what boat is this? 13 foot. It's, it's around, uh, I think it's 21.5 and it's got a 15 horsepower Suzuki. We use, all our boats come standard with um, Garmin, MFD, Sight and Sonar, Depth Finder. I love that. And we have um, a, 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 a digital tack that's a NEMA 2000, communicates with the brain of the motor. Beautiful. Hey, where can they go online to get some information? Rivetboats.com. Rivetboats.com? Hey, I'm a fan. And how much is this one right here? 22,000? Yep. This is our boat show special, uh, 21,850. With a, with a 50, guys. Hey, that, that's, that's, that's a good price point, man. Thank you. All right, guys, we got some big boats over here. I saw you earlier and you were talking about this chair, but this is not wood. Welcome to Seabreeze Casual, where we make have premium American-made. Oh, no, that guy, that guy's my, he's like a super fan. He doesn't get away from me, dude. This guy's like the fan of all fans. Oh, wait, what do you think? Yes. What do you think, guys? I love it. What do you think, guys? I want the Calentona hat. Da Calentona. There's a long story behind Calentona. There's a whole story behind it. Where are you at? Finish with Sea Breeze. I'm going to pass by. Gonna pass by. I'm with Reaper. Where are you? Reaper. Okay, I'm going to pass by now. See you. All right, so because I've been doing these shows for a long time, a lot of people know me. He actually has a plate. I've done a podcast. It's, it's, it's a long story. Let's go back to your chairs because I might want, want one in the back of my house. Sure. Okay, Seabreeze Casual, is that? Yes, this is the okay, business but... name. We do custom logos. Okay. And we have a lot of poly outdoor themes. I love this. It's all American made. It's maintenance free. No mold? Or if, if it does get mold, you put some Clorox and it's gone. You can pressure wash it. You can do whatever you want. How much? What are we talking about? $749. With the engraving. $749. $749. With, with the, all this engraving, guys. Various colors. It's easy to clean. It stays pretty clean. There's, it's got all stainless I, I'll, steel. I'll take this to the sandbar, by the way. You know that, right? And it's, it won't get messed up. It's all stainless steel fasteners, so it will withstand the salt, the wind. It's fairly heavy. It won't blow away. You can drop it in the pool. Look at this one. This one also That's looks... Wood okay, so, but this... It looks like wood, but it's not. It's not wood. All right. This, this is this where they can go right here? This is made. Is this where they yes, can go? Absolutely, yes. I'm going to send when, you attention. When, when, when he's doing oh, video, my goodness. When, Another one. You, listen. Video, wait. It will, it will this, this man has an amazing boat. Amazing. I did a video. Where's your boat, Uli? You don't have no other boat here? Coming, coming. All right. I'm going to see you. I'm, I'm working. I'm working. Guys, wait for it. Hay problema, nada, ni problema, dale, no, hay no, problema, no, hay no, problema. Hey, bro. No, everybody else has problems, we have situations. They have problems, we don't have problems, they have situations. Oh, challenges. Challenges, there you go, that's, that's a smart thinking man. Hey, look at this guy, look at him, look at him, look at him. Yeah, he's putting me. That's why, the last time I went to the bathroom, I am uh, behind Black Point. And all of a sudden, he sends me a peacekeeper, and he goes, I tell loco, I tell loco, I tell loco. No, I'm not. All right, all right, listen, I want to do a uh, reef runner walkthrough, let's go. All right, guys, hey, 
Wait for it, Alfonso from Atlantic Marine. What's up, my people? Welcome to the Miami International Boat Show. Atlantic Marine Store is proud to be a refront and dealer. Let's go upstairs. Oh, I'm, I'm going to have to take off my shoes, ain't oh, I? This is a nice boat. You're going to have to take off your shoes. I'm going to have to take off my shoes, How guys. Are you hey, I'm, give, I'm giving you an edit, dude. I'm giving you an edit. <laughs> guys, I am giving him an edit. All right, so he does not have audio. You're going to have to speak up a little bit because I don't have you mic'd up and you know how I do it, run and gun. Okay, first of all, I've never been on a reef runner ever. First time, so tell me a little bit about the company. I know, I know that if you're representing them, you have to like them a lot. I love this boat a lot. Now this is a very nice handmade boat. It's three piece and this was built by Donna Mello. Reef Runner has been in business now for eight years. Okay. And she has the 23, the 28, and the 34. What questions do you have? I don't want questions. I want you to show me the boat. All right, come on down. So, so, so all right. this is a standard 34 with twin 300s. Top speed is 55 miles an hour. How, wait, wait, hold on. How, how yes. fast? 55. That's, that's, that's a good moving that's boat. That's really nice. Max horsepower is 1,500. Okay. So you can go triple 500. You can do what I would like is the twin 400 V10s. You can go with that or twin 350 Suzuki's or the twin 350 Yami's. Woo! Is this boat for sale? Is yes. this, it this is. One is. This one is sold. We would have to pre-order, make your boat. You're looking at How, six to seven months wait. Six to seven months. Okay. Yeah. All right. So, all right. Let's walk and tell me let's go. what they got. Because I already see already right. a lot of things here. Every step on the flooring. Okay. Very nice. This is magnetic. Tackle drawer, more little storage, put your phone and stuff away there. You got a nice big uh big drive wall right here. Side door. I like this. Some door, yes. This is magnetic, which is really cool and it does not come off, bro. Really, really nice. Lots of storage. You got a cooler in there if you want to put stuff. Oh yeah. Thanks. Model in the house. I saw it. <laughs> I saw it. 34 feet, 10 feet wide, super big T-top. And look at this. Look at this, guys. Yes. yes, we can make them different options. If you want to powder coat it, you just want the stainless, we can do that too. Upgraded seating. Step on that foam padding right there, bro. Check that out for your feet. This is called Gator Step. Oh, I like this. Oh, I know it, is, uh, it is. That is nice. It is really nice. I won't show my feet because I know my audience. Uh, ah, at the logo. So, no, so when is the Calentona hat going to be ready? The Calentona hat, um, I don't know. I have to I have to ask him if he wants to. Uh... <laughs> and what's up with the glasses? Let me see them. Oh, my goodness, guys. Hey, they're, they might be a little dirty. Those Ooh. are my hook. Okay. But they, 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 right they, the they look good on you, dude. Man, they, good. they look good on you. Yeah. Okay, those, those are hooks. I have, listen, I have, I have the hooks. Those are the big eye. I like the big uh, eye. I'm a big eye. Uh, okay, well, the other ones are nice too. The Bill Fisher and the last car are badass. I saw one that you put for your girl. Which one's that one then? Um, she has the, uh, it's the aviator one. What's it called? Hey, hey, hey. You showed it. You put it, you posted it up. So oh, the, I so forgot the, the name. I, uh, she got it. She, lo right, she loves it. Down, put it back no, 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 no. Okay, so look, let's go back to this because okay. this, this is this Big is ve this is very nice. I, I really like. Notice how they, they they went downwards on the console here, so you never lose the sight of the bow. I like that. Yeah. And I like this in the center as well. Yeah. Your compass in the no, middle. That's the old school. I, I, li I like that. You got uh, Mercury set up. Sea Keeper right. So now you don't even have to mess with the trim tabs. Okay, talk to them about Seakeeper Ride. Okay, so Seakeeper Ride is a great system, especially for those new boaters out there that do not know how to use trim tabs and understand it very well. It's basically taking care of that job for, your, for itself. So if there's movement around, if you got a lot of weight shifting from side to side, Seakeeper Ride will keep you stable at all times. And that's on the transom of the boat? That's on the transom of the boat. Interesting, so it's not like a, a gyro. No. But it, it does the same function? Man, this is going to take over the trim tabs. I'm telling you. It's going to be very, uh, something that's going to be standard on boats. Get ready for that one. Oh my goodness, guys. Yeah. You heard it here. Alfonso from Atlantic Marine. Okay, so we got, okay, so tell Check me about, tell me, tell me, wait, tell me about the seating options here because. Seating options. So we can eliminate the seat in the back and just keep it like a whole tackle drawer. You, 
can go with the LeBrock seating. You can change the seating. This one folds down really nice. You know, different color options as well. Very custom, very custom. Not all refunders are the same. A lot of boats are custom made, so they're kind of like one of one at all times. This boat looks well, well, well made. This is called um, Mean Fighting, Lady Fighting Yellow. I like this. I know. This is from the old school Vikings mm -hmm. and the old school Bertrams. Check this out. No. Yeah. Yo, this is huge, dude. It's big in there. What? Hey. Very comfortable. You know, if you need that private time to use a restroom. And you have access to all your electronics right there. Right through. there. Right I like there. that. Yeah. Really, really nice. That's gonna that's gonna sell. That's gonna sell. The the wife is gonna like that that yes. part of the boat too. Lots guys. of storage. Lots of fish box. You can, the seating up here is optional. You can remove it. I like it. I like this layout. I, no, I like this layout. Even even to fish. I know. I like this layout. I'd rather. I, I personally. I keep it like this. It doesn't really bother me. It doesn't. You know why? Because listen, realistically, you can fish all around here if you want to, and if you wanted to stand up on, you can. Very Your fun. gunnels are wide. I'll tell you the freeboard is really high on this boat. This is a dry boat, isn't it? This is a dry boat. This is an offshore dry boat. Yeah, I can, I can tell, guys. Absolutely. This looks like a dry, dry boat. Okay, so what's this guy here? Reef runner 23. <laughs> so right now you've got some customers looking at the 23. They're very interested. They're probably gonna order one. I was talking to them. Oh wait, I was talking to them a little while ago. Yeah, you know them? No, I don't know them, but they know the channel and they were looking at and they said they're gonna buy a reef runner. And I told them. That's right. Hey, hey. Two, two, two of your favorite celebrities right here, bro. Hey. Now you gotta buy which, which one are you gonna buy? Is, this, is it gonna be this one? I Listen, bro, he's gonna give you a discount because of me. I will. Listen, I don't will. worry about it. Don't play, you know, don't play the poker face. Just say yes, give me the best deal, Alfonso. Best deal. Let's go. Let's get it. Okay, look, all right, let's talk about money real quick because I gotta, I gotta walk the show and, and I'm being tormented by these hot dogs and I gotta get I out know, of this the, section. The I, I'm, it's, it's horrible. I've been here all day with it. Uh, starting price on this is three ninety five. Three ninety five. How is, far can it go? Oh, as far as your pockets can go. Woo! You know? Yeah. This one as is is at four thirty nine. Four thirty nine yeah. as is right now. That's it. Everything Boat show here. special. Boat show special, and we'll okay. get it ready in six to seven months. Okay. Anything under this area here or anything we got? No, no, no. Okay. Here because you have the Tell me a little bit about the hatches and the fishing and all that good stuff because you know our diehards are gonna say lots of storage. There you go. That's what we want to nice see. So can you see this boat going the other side to, 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 to the Bahamas? Oh, absolutely. That's all day. It. This is what it's meant for. This, does not, this is for offshore. Let's go travel across the Atlantic. Absolutely. Let's go. Let's go make some memories Let's away go. from home. Let's go. Let's do it. Not at Honeymoon, uh, not at, uh, honeymoon Harbor anymore. Happy Valentine's Day. Ah, thank you. You want to be my Valentine's Day? I'm getting out of here. I got kind of weird, weird quick right here. Hey, stay tuned, Calentona. Hats, oh my goodness! Shirt, hey, did, tell me, did you like? Me. Did you like it though? Yes, I know. I know everything about the Calentona. But well, the Calentona hat was my was my idea spot on. It's perfect, <laughs> bro. That it couldn't get any better than that. No, no, that's perfect. Guys, check out my hats. Luxury rib tenders. I'm gonna put a QR code. Just just take a picture of the QR code and that'll take you. But the Calentona hat is coming out soon. You know what? Let's do Fred the Croc eating like Calentona. Ah! Oh. Whoa! Hey. That can be a manslaughter I, charge. I, I don't want nothing. I just want a free hat. That's oh right. my goodness, guys. All right. Well, listen, I'm going to cut real quick and we're going to get back into the show. I want to thank Alfonso Atlantic Marine. Get, give me your, your info real quick. AtlanticMarineStore.com. Give us a call. 305-826-2202. And let's take care of you. Out. And it continues. Guys, what an amazing boat. Beautiful reef runner. And wait for it. Oh boy. Come on, let's go. You got a boat to show. You gotta, you're not you gonna you're not gonna make money you talking to John. Get over here, let's go. Come on. Come here, come here, come here. No, because you're the one getting dirty. Get in there. Get in there. Get, that's it, you're in there. Hey, come here. Come on. All right, come here. Come here. All right, guys, VTech. Go ahead, introduce yourself. Bro, they're gonna, who are they gonna talk to when you buy it? Who are they gonna talk to? All right, guys, get over here, guys. VTech in the house. You know, I like to give them love because I, I do believe they make an amazing boat. 
I love. He's scared. He's scared. He's always been. He's always been scared of the camera, guys. So. I try every year. I try every single year. I try. We have a couple. Por qué ese hombre no quiere estar en YouTube? He doesn't like to be on camera, but why? Think, why? I why? Oh, it, well, because Because you look better on camera, anyways. Let's go ahead and talk Thank about this VTEC. So this is an 18 foot flat boat. We built her out of Miami, Florida. She is. Um, she's a little mean machine. She has a insulated compartment on each side, 19 gallons each, which could be converted into a secondary live well. She drafts about 9 to 11 inches. This boat, as she sits right now, has dual Raptor um, anchor, eight footers with a 200. She's powered with a 200 Pro XS. Um, it's beautiful. And, and I, you know, there's somebody at Black Point that comes in and then out of. Really? Yes. She they has, come in uh, out of Black Point, guys. She has her jack plate and her tabs, which is for me a must on this boat. Her live well is. What is she drafting? So she, she drafts about 9 to 11 inches, depending on how light you keep her. Um, I always saw all of her customers that you keep her light, she, she'll draft at least. Uh, this particular build has dual 9 inch garments. She is, um, she's, she's a beauty, she really is. Her build access is a, is, is a mechanic's dream. So she has a full access right here. Oh with, my goodness, look at the size of this, guys. You got, you got your pumps, you got your battery, complete, full, clean access. Um, I love the steering wheel, how uh, it's all set up. You got your garments. I like this little console. And, and what, where's your live well on this? Our live well is here in the back. She's 29 gallons right here on the back. Oh, right here. Okay, I see her now. Right here, she's 29 gallons. There's a live well right there. Tons of options. She's, okay. she's, she's not this one, the way we're seeing it right here. Miami Boat Show 2024, what are we looking at price point? We're looking at boat engine trailer powered with a, a Mercury 150 Pro XS, 59,000 and she's yours. 60K? That's it. That's it. That's it. Wait boat for it, guys. And then there's room for tons of options and we'll customize her any way you like it. Let me tell you, you guys are doing a good job. Thank you so uh, much, Alfred. He, he, should, he should be proud to be on camera because the but team, proud of his the build. team, uh, that's right. That's what I was going to say. Yeah. They're making incredible boats and you see it on the finishes, guys. Look at the finishes on these boats. Yeah, her fit and finish is, is, is like no other. And okay, uh, give, give me the address where I can go ahead and film with my E at night when he's pulling in. Okay, and I'm just so, going to bother. <laughs> so because he's a hard worker, 2323 Northwest 149th Street, that's where we're at. My name is Cheeky, his name is Alain. Either of us can help you out. All right, let me go ahead and give him one, one last time hard try time. Try to catch him, try to catch him. Hold on. Excuse me, sir. Uh, can I ask you a question, oh, please? <laughs> Let it go. Get out of here. Hey, good job. Good job on the boat. <laughs> Wait for it, guys. Well, we continue here. Oh, there's nothing like being at home, my friends. And I've been traveling, guys. I've been traveling a lot. 2024, showing you guys the boats of the world. And I hope you guys smash those like buttons because it does help immensely. Um, one of the things when I was traveling the world, what I saw a lot of was a lot of rib boats, rigid inflatable boats, especially in Dusseldorf. Wait for it, Italia boats! How you doing, my friend? How are you? Good. How are you guys? So, I was just telling my audience, I went to Dusseldorf boat show. Did you see it? Uh, I did. I saw all the rib boats. Yes, guys. So many. Look, the new entry, the 38 Black Edition. 38. Okay, so so we're getting we're getting. Okay, can I go up on there yes, or no? Sir. Hold on, guys. Let, I need to take out my shoes real quick. Yes, thank you. All right, guys, let's go. We're gonna continue here at the boat show. Oh my goodness. I mean, guys, I'm telling you, this is one of those shows, guys. One of those shows. Oh my my. One of the things that I did not and I was unable because of lack of time was to go on all the rib boats that I wanted to while I went to the Dusseldorf uh, boat show, guys. An incredible boat show. Like I said, I, I, I would encourage you guys to watch that video. All right, the Cayman 38 Executive. 
Oh my my. Let's go ahead and get on here. Wow, dude, this thing is beautiful. Look at the beam on this guy. Where did he go? We just lost him, guys. Yes, this bad boy has a cabin. Wait a second. This thing is beautiful. Introduce yourself so they know who so you are. I'm Vincenzo Italia Boots. We do Ranieri here. We are the dealer for the United States for Ranieri. And you're always going out of haul over on these boats. I see you out haul over all the time. So uh, this is beautiful. Beautiful. I love this. You know, you know I'm a big fan of rib boats. That's my favorite boat. Rib boats is my favorite. And I say, that's why yeah. Uh, listen guys, uh, it's not a secret if you've been following my channel, you know that I will pick a rib boat before anything. We have electric table. Beautiful. I love this. Oh wait, yeah. wait, you got this on the yeah, corner? Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. It's going to be under there. You can put on so the you, middle. Oh nice. So you can you go can ahead. Have a sun pad. On the back. Sun pad, because the Italians like to show off. That's right. Yes. Yes. I like that. All right. Let's go up front before we go into the... Okay. Guys, so... A lot of these Italian-made boats, they like to lay out, get sun. Okay, so what's under these cushions? What's under this the cushions? Is, this is full sea deck and okay. it's cabin under that. That's why they don't have a storage, but it's big cabin to the twin bed. Okay, we're talking about Orca Hypalon. Orca Hypalon, carburetor. Okay, red, guys, carbon fiber Orca Hypalon multiple chambers if you see the chambers this is a chamber there's another chamber on that side there's two chambers over there and what essentially a rib boat has it has a, a dividing line a chamber you see right here there's a there's a baffle in here that doesn't let air go that way and now it just uses on this chamber until this chamber here okay so it's essentially if you pop this only the front area will be down and remember, a rib boat, you can use it. A rib boat's not gonna sink even if you turn, take all the air from all the, all right. all the tubes. You can go even without so, the tube, you can go out. And, 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 and it's been hard for me to, to explain that to people because they think that a rib boat, you'd lose the air and that's in it. Europe, like, you know, no, it's Europe additional, boat, guys. It's 80% of boats in the world that it's inflatable. Okay, so, and he's absolutely right. A lot of boats in the world are inflatables because they're lighter they're seaworthy lighter, stable, fast in, in faster, a lot of cases they're faster yes gas. yes and the reason oh boats. my goodness look at this wait a second this is like a house in here oh boy hold on guys this is huge Oh my. You have another room here on the back. You see, this I wouldn't have thought. I love it. This, this is, is okay, what, what boat is this? Is this a brand new haul for you guys? A brand new boat? No, we... You've been making this one for a while? Yes, okay. for a while, yes. But this is the first time, this is the first time I see this one. Yes, we uh, just bring this one to United States. This is the first one come to United States. That's why I haven't seen we it. We sold another one. It's going to be next month. Guys, look at this. This is crazy, dude. This is a rib boat, guys. This is a 38-foot rib boat. How far we have come in the rib boat game, guys. Let me tell you something. When I first started my channel, oh my goodness, and it's got... It's got a head in here and everything. The lights are shut off. But it's got a shower. You turn on the light from Where? The, on front of you, yeah. Down? Yeah. Oh, there it goes. That's your weight, yeah, but the sun. Go ahead. I think I missed it. There it goes. Oh, that's awesome. So, okay. How fast is this one going? 55 miles per hour with the twin 400. 55 miles per hour. Now, 
what are the options that you can do? 70 gallon refrigerator. And I like it. It's have air condition. Similar to 12 inch, 9 inch. That's used with the NEMA for the engine. Bow thruster, we can put a joystick. Yeah. I love this, guys. I love this. That is absolutely awesome. Okay, wh wh how much? How much are we talking about money-wise? This is five hundred twenty thousand retail MRSP. We have a bolt to offer okay. for four hundred eighty thousand dollars. Four hundred and eighty thousand dollars, guys. All the things you've seen here, thirty-eight foot of amazingness. Where can they go online or to see your channel? Italia Boats. Okay. .com. We have a boat trading. The award. Give your number. Three zero five three four five. 0599 Vincenzo. All right, guys, we're gonna continue walking the Miami boat show. Let's go! Where's my hook? Where's my hook? Where's my hook? Sunglasses. Oh, wait, wait, my hook lens. Hook. This this is brought to you by hook, guys. This is brought to you by hook. Oh my goodness. I was finally able to use the freaking hook sunglasses to show you guys how amazing this is, guys. Look at the manatees just, just came in. There's a baby back there. There's a baby back there. Oh my goodness. Watch this. You can't see nothing now, huh? It's barely, just barely. Oh, the hook sunglasses. The hook lenses for the wind, guys. Oh my goodness. How awesome is that? You guys saw the one in the back? That is so cool, dude. So cool. This is, guys, this is why you want to be careful out here. I mean, I'll tell you, I am so so pleased to have this to show you guys what happens on the water right that's so cool dude that is so cool guys now if i take off the lens you can barely see anything but that is that is pretty cool that is so cool dude how awesome is that we're gone, we're gone guys. We continue the walk and the talk here at the show. Wow, all I can say is wow, wow, wow. It feels like, it feels like we haven't even started this show and I've already, I've already left my bag back there. And wait, my bag. I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. I did, yes, yes, too many. Too many problems I would have if I got... Oh, yes! Yes, guys. This is how it happens. You, sir, are awesome. All right, let's go. Let's get into the other side of the show, guys. All right. So, what is up with the music? Um, everybody's got music going crazy over here, guys. But we're going to continue over here walking. And like I said, it just feels like we just started the show and all of a sudden, this place, we haven't even gotten into the tent yet, my goodness. All right, so keep in mind, this is gonna be a multiple part uh, series, guys. Cause this is the docks. At some point I have to film the convention center. Look at this quirking. Hold on a second. I gotta see something real quick. I gotta see something real quick because if I don't check, yeah, there we go. All right, let's go ahead and continue. All right, guys, we got some pricing here, so I'm gonna see if I let you guys know some of the pricing. Now, keep in mind, boat prices have been going down. So I think there's a lot of leverage that you guys as buyers have so keep that in mind. And Mike, yeah. Hey. What's that? That's me. What are you showing us your ass? Oh, there you go. Yeah, show this guy. You know who this guy is? Yeah. No, he it's doesn't. Ah, I can't go anywhere anymore, damn it. I can't go anywhere, dude. He's hey. famous. Or what's up with Even these up boats? In Boston. in Boston. I'm in Boston. Boston. I'm gonna go to Boston. I, I, That's what this is, Boston. You, you know who my boy is? Who? Maneri. Bob Maneri. Wow. You don't know who Bob Maneri is? 
I don't know. I just, I'm just name calling. I don't know the guy either, but I watch him on YouTube. See, I've never heard of ah, him. he's from he's from the Full Send podcast. You gotta know who I am. This is the cap this, oh, okay, so who are you? This is your uncle Kevin from Boston. Okay, so who are you? I, what do you do, dude? I don't know. I fish. So this is okay, okay, so you're a fisherman. Yeah. A okay, fisherman. what type of fishing do you do? Stripers. Stripers. Albies. Okay, where can fish. how oh, wait, how do they find you on this channel? Um, yeah, no, right yeah. on this right on this channel right yeah. here. Get tight, Get sports. tight sports fishing. Where, tight where sports. is that on, on YouTube? Winthrop. It's in Boston. It's in Boston. Winthrop, but, Mass. Okay, but are you put, where are you posting your fishing? Um, we Instagram. Don't, Instagram. That's why I don't know you, Instagram, bro. Instagram, Facebook. He's on, he's on Instagram. I need you on YouTube for me to watch. YouTube? I need you on YouTube. Okay. So, okay, I'm going to send them to your Instagram. Send them to my Instagram. Send them to Get Tight Sport Fishing. Get Tight Sport Fishing, guys. I'm, I'm Get it, Tight Sport. Did you guys see anything you like? Huh? Oh yeah, yeah. We walked around quite a bit. We uh, we looked at the new 350 from Yamaha. Super nice. I talked about that. I saw that one in you can go in Toronto. For everyone that has like 150s, you can drop down to like twin, uh, a single 350. You're gonna say 500 pounds. Wait oh. for it. Oh, yes. Yeah. Hey, thank you for watching, bro. Oh, thank you. Hey. Big fan. Huge I'm fan. I'm a fan now because you. you have the confidence That's right. of a fisherman. That's right. Hey. I, got, I got dolphin in my blood. Really? Yes. I got blowfish in my blood. What Russia. the hell does that mean? Hey, there's a place in Russia. They put dolphin <laughs> blood in there. Uh, Wait. Hello? Yeah, I'm over here on the other side by Quirkin. By Quirkin over here on the other side. Uh, the opposite side of Reef Runner. Uh, all right, bye. There's a place in Russia, they inject you with dolphin blood and you can become the ocean. No, really? Yeah, I heard they hell lot it. <laughs> Not in, uh, here in America. Bro, in Russia, that's why they you put went dolphin Russia. blood in you. Does it make you swim fast? So, you're a, so, fast? so you swim fast? Lightning. Really? Yes. I've it's never so been fast. so you bullshitted in my life. <laughs> hey. this, this Boston bullshit is really, <laughs> really... Hey, I'm going to follow you now, guys. It only happens here. Uh, I love messing around with the, the people. I actually don't know his channel, but you know what? Um, fishing, guys. Fishing, fishing, fishing. It's, uh, it's an amazing sport. And the memories. Guys, we're, we're running out of time. We're all running out of time. Make as many memories as you can. When somebody tells you, hey, I need to stress you out, you tell them, I'm running out of time. I'm running out of time. Ain't that a fact? Beautiful. Um, I think on the other side, we're going to inject ourselves with dolphin blood over there too, guys. I don't know. Sea hunt in the house. They were saying about the 350. So I want to talk about that real quick. Oh, boy. Wait for it. Hey, I got to put a battery in here. A lot of good things happening, guys. A lot of good things happening behind the scenes. Um, so, Ultra 34, 234. Yeah, that's $170,000. Look at this, guys. So, some of these boats are actually on both sides. Some of them will be on the docks, and some of them will also be at the convention center which will be on another video hey dolphin blood for real <laughs> yeah buddy it's no joke 28 percent of what he says you can it's actually no listen joke 28 percent. you already have it figured out you're a good friend 28 hey. percent of it Listen, yeah, we gotta pay it's attention no joke to. but i gotta go uh get a couple numbers what part of russia did you go to get that 28 percent the center of the air. it's off of main street i'm not too sure <laughs> <laughs> Uh, uh, off of Main Street? Yeah. They don't have a Main Street! <laughs> Alright guys. In Ronald Reagan Boulevard, that's where it was! <laughs> oh my goodness guys. Czar is in the house. Imagine this coming out of your yacht. You jump in. Everybody's going to look at you. They're going to say, how cute is that? But it's not just cute, guys. It's seaworthy and it's practical. 
because it gets you to the restaurant you want to go to have a daiquiri in some amazing island somewhere. You got to visualize, guys. You got to visualize. If not, things won't happen. Czar, czar, czar. Now, I filmed some pretty big ones over there in Europe. Next level. Um, probably three, four times bigger than the ones here, but they're slowly building a brand over here, guys. Rib boats are making it to the market here. All right. East Cape in the house. Alfred, what's up? <laughs> hold on, I want to introduce you to somebody. Wait, hold on. Before you introduce me to somebody, okay. somebody came up to me and asked me about your boat. Well, I hope so. And I said... We're the star of the show. I said, absolutely. You got to go check them out. And I said, they're good people. Well, I, you know we're good people, but I want to introduce you to somebody else who's good people. So he has a huge base here on YouTube. This is Will and his wife. They're the uh, they're one of the owners of Turtle Box. So let me show you this. Turtle right. what? Come here. Check this out. All right, guys. Let's go. This is just East Cape just got interesting over here. Oh, boy. Waterproof floats, shockproof, bury it. I'm going to let Will give you guys a little speech that we're going to talk about what's different for us. So, Will, you're on blast. Okay, cool. What do we got, Will? Yeah, it's the only marine grade portable speaker. So that's kind of our big differentiator. Super loud. Everything's, all the hardware is marine grade, stainless hardware, titanium tweeter, six by nine. The battery will last. And this will float in the water? It'll float in the water. But uh, is it meant to be in the water? Like, is it like, if I wanted to go and, and just hold it next to my hand at the sandbar, just, oh, yeah. it's, just literally, that's what it's meant for? Totally waterproof, submersible. And, um, the battery, wow. The battery will last you about a good three day weekend. Where's the charge point in, on it? I want to see the charge point. So it's got a sticker. I don't want to take the sticker. No, off. no, but okay, though, yeah. Flip that up, and it's got. Uh, it'll charge your phone. You can also obviously charge the box, and it's got an aux cord and mic input too. So. So how long would that last? About a three-day weekend. A three days? Yeah, I charge. I charge mine every couple weeks, and they last a really long time. So it's got some lithium-ion batteries or yeah. phosphate batteries. It's a lithium-ion lithium. uh, big battery bank. So. Okay. Um, where yeah. can they go online? Yeah, turtleboxaudio.com, or you can scan that little QR code. Guys, check them out. Let me know in the comments below if you have one. Hey, you got blasted. Right, Come here, let's talk about boats. Okay, let's Get talk over. about boats. Where, where have you been? Where have you been? Why haven't you followed me around? You always follow me around. You know who I met a little while ago? Robert Arrington from Deer Meat for Dinner. He's good people. He's a great guy. He's good people. I'm actually not hungry right now because he bought me lunch. Lunch, uh, where we're we gonna eat lunch now because yeah. I'm fat. Let's uh, go. All right, well, all right, let's talk about the boat first. Nobody ever knows when you're puffing up. Uh, all, right, all, right. all right, so what we have again the new open. I think you saw that last year at Lauderdale. However, this is the first one with twins. This is twin 200. So if you fish near shore, offshore, let's go. Let's go up here real quick. I'm not gonna get in. Okay, you can, you can, you. All right, guys. Go, go, go. So the 25 Open is the boat that everybody's asked for because number one, it's under 30 feet. It is priced right. Uh, I just found out that we're actually the same or less than some of the production bigger boat brands here at the show. However, price aside, the fin finish, what we're known for is there. But check it out. We have Shimano came on board and helped us out this year, showing off some new gear. Hey, this is the, this is the boat that that person was asking me about. Yep. About the 25. Yep, and twin 200. So if you want to go to Bimini, if you want to go offshore, you want to go to West Bank, um, the boat will do it, the boat can handle it. But if you're always worried about a single engine setup, just know the boat can take duels up to 400. So here's twin 200 Mercuries. No, off, Suzuki's. Suzuki's, I'm sorry. On a uh, Porter bracket. Uh, we do all brands. Uh, we love Suzuki. They've been great to us. We have a boat in the water at their booth. Let's go show the profile the, uh, on the boat because I want to see this. I want them to see this. Tell me a little bit about this because I can already tell that a lot of people don't know the, the design. And tell me a little bit about the design so of the, the hull. the influence off of this came off of your typical center console offshore 32. Uh, we wanted that flat floor, that true center console. We call it the open because the boat is actually open, meaning you can walk all the way around. We have a huge coffin box lounger. 
it's insulated. Everything in this boat drains outside. We didn't put floor hatches because the whole bottom of the boat is sealed and has flotation. We want to make sure you can get home. If it doesn't uh, interfere with the integrity of the boat and the safety of you, we just won't do it. Um, at the end of the day, this boat was designed for those people that want to be able to go offshore, near shore, under 30 feet, have something they could tow and store, and manage by themselves. So again, you got the huge spray rails that we're known for. A, uh, water... tell, me, tell me a little bit about that, because maybe they haven't seen this. Okay, so water follow is the leading edge. So you have the Carolina flare that goes out. That's oh. great, it works. Um, but the wind can grab it and throw it on you. What we have developed and protected is that we have the spray rail up here. So if it passes the chine, and chine, by the way, for everybody that doesn't know, is where the side and the bottom come together. So if it passes this, it comes up, and you can see down here it's curved. Well, it throws the water down. So by the time the wind grabs it, if it does grab it, you've already gone by before it comes over you. The other thing it does is if you're in a following sea, and you know those videos that you always see going out of all over yes. and these other canals. If you're in a following sea, this will also give resistance to keep the bow up. But if this wasn't here, like your typical V, it will actually slice and dive. But because of this, this has resistance. So it keeps the bow up. And then again, remember we have a rounded transom. A rounded transom is just like you see on the sport fish boats. I don't understand why everybody you know, doesn't do this, but again, it's, it's unique to us as we have a rounded transom angled back. So what that does is it forces water this way, not this way. It also makes it quiet on the drift, and it also makes it easier in reverse. It's about 30%, I would say, snappier or more responsive when you're reversing. So instead of it digging down, it actually comes up. So very efficient. I understand that's why sport fish boats do it, and that's why we did it on our 25. What's the price point of, a, of an East Cape 25 right now? Okay, so- 2024. Oh, okay, so the, uh, the 25 open, it's 2410, we just call it the 25. But the 25 open, boat, motor, trailer, 300, jack plate, uh, console, ready to fish, the MSRP on that boat is gonna be approximately 151. The average one going out the door, full transparency to everybody here, is the average one mile to wild is gonna be anywhere from the 160s to just over 200. We have people putting sea keepers, upper station, open radars. This even has night flur on the front. Um, is this boat sold? Yes, sir. It is. This boat is going to... Uh, and, and you can literally walk on all these gunnels. Yes. I mean, this is like, I mean, it's it's completely open. You can walk and fish around yes. it, but if you want to jump up top, you have, yes. I, you literally, you have a dance floor up here, guys. Look at this. And here's the other thing. The crowd that's um, into the fishing, the inshore stuff, uh -huh. please don't forget the vantage. Our bread and butter is also the skiff market. The other cool thing is, I don't know if you went to the electronics area, but Simrad... Not yet. Not with the new MFD. We're one of the few builders to partner and show it off. Here's the new 7x15. So for everybody that likes, whether you drive a pontoon boat, a center console, or a skiff, when you run your mapping with it being 15 inches, it actually has a better feel and the imaging looks a lot better than your typical 7, 9, or 12 inch MFD. So this is new from Simran. I like that. We had a 12 inch in there, but they gave us that. We popped it out. We popped this one in. Um, okay, so you're giving a turtle with every purchase of the boat? Of a skip, yeah. <laughs> you're, gonna, uh, you're getting a free turtle? Uh, you're a turtle, a free turtle box if uh, you place an order at, the, uh, at Miami this week. But again, it's, it's uh, very rare that we get to uh, see Will. I only get to see Will maybe two times a year, the owner of Turtle Box. Give, give, give your number because I want okay. them to call you. So my name is Kevin. I'm one of the owners at East Cape. But again, it's not about me. It's about the staff. It's about our customers. But my number is 321 217 one zero eight six been in business 21 years um you come a long way from not coming to boat shows i know bro we love you bro i i, I, I love, love your audience I, I, because we love reading the comments i love it hey awesome awesome boats good guys you, hey good to see you here Thanks, in miami guys wow i am blown away already and we haven't even entered the show let's go ahead and cross over and let's go guys let's go all right, so we're in air conditioned. Oh, this, this feels so nice, guys. Okay, we're gonna have, there's, there's all types of, uh, of, of different companies that'll be here at the show, guys. Uh, they're also at the convention center. The convention center has a huge area. So some of these companies, oh look, 
Doc mate, yep. this is this is this is kind of like to help you dock your boat. Guys, this right here will be the death of the Chicho. You will literally be able to dock your boat wirelessly. How cool is that? Love this. No, no, don't worry about it. No, no, it's okay. I was just showing this because... I love your show. Thank you. I, you know, this is the death of my show, though. You guys will be the death of uh, the Chicho. Because right. everybody will know how to dock their boat easily. That's what I was just going to say. Well... Okay, so wait, know. can you explain the system real quick while I'm here real quick? Sure. Okay, so guys, um, what's your name? Jim. Okay, so so I'm a fan of this product. You know, a friend of mine's uh, uh, Big Boat Ben. Mm -hmm. Ben, awesome guy, brought me to your booth one year. Um, I saw it, I was on, on a little tipsy, it was late in the day, I had a couple drinks and I said, I can't film these guys, they're gonna ruin the chit show. And then, no, 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 it's nothing good. But I was like, wow, this is really good innovation, right? So tell me about it. So, okay, so you have your, your boat, you're yep. trying, you need to dock it, what does the dock mate do? For a wireless remote, for your, your interface with your controls. We're just demonstrating here the various controls we can interface with. Okay. But basically, we can just move your boat with this remote, like a joystick, and or a helm in your hand. Okay, so so what system do I need to, to, to integrate the Dockmate with? Usually electronic controls with at least a ballast thruster, maybe a stern thruster, or pods, IPS, or anything like that. Okay, so are you seeing it more on like diesel yacht applications, or? No, we're doing on JPO boats. We do gas boats as well, you know, okay. the outboards and stuff. You can see here, here's one of the boats we just did. Victor, I'm, uh, I'm loving this. Okay, so do you have, do you have uh, dealers that will install this or is it an easy install for somebody no, to we, do? We, we have a dealer network, you have okay. to be certified installer to do, put it in. It's not, the installation is very simple, okay. but it's the programming of the software that makes And it's it all here, this is wirelessly yep. where you're gonna, rem yep. yeah, you, you would definitely kill the chit show, guys. My boat ramp channel will be dead in six months. Well, it's not if keep, everybody had it, I'm done. It's not going to keep the people who are driving their ah, trailers into the water. There you go. That, that, what about Alfred? Oh, Fred. You're talking Fred, about Fred, Fred the Croc. Fred, yes. Fred, Fred. Fred is there waiting for the cops to jump in the water. You know how it is. He only shows up when the police come and remove a truck from the, from the water. Yeah, okay, no. where, they, where, they, where can they go online? Docmate.us. Docmate.us? Yep. All right, guys, check them out. And check out our YouTube channel. Just go to YouTube and Google Docmate. You'll see we have a bunch of videos. They're very cool, very informative. The installation process and all the different applications we utilize. Hey, I know a captain uh, from the Curse Robalo that he still will crash the boat over there at Blackway. Even with the Docmate. I'm out of here, guys. <laughs> all right, that's awesome. Hey, you want uh, some uh, lunch? Come on here. Come over here and have some lunch, guys. You can have lunch, you can have drinks, you can have a little bit of everything. Honda Power. Okay, what's going on here? Oh, I don't know if I can get out of there. It says an emergency exit. It looks like Mercury has a booth over there. I did some good uh, videos in uh, Toronto, guys, of some of the manufacturers. But let's go ahead and get on these docks. Because this is, this is what I want to show you guys. This is what I want to show you guys. All right. Um, I think, I think I want to show you this, but in a part two. So I'm going to walk out here. This has got to be a two part show guys. It's just too long or yeah, we're going to do this. Two parts. Let's go. Today's video was brought to you by Hook Optics. To get more information on Hook Sunglasses, go to hooksunglasses.com. Whiskey throttle hats and chit show gear are also available at luxuryribtenders.com. Don't forget to smash that like button on the way out.